suddenly they all stripped away from us all those things that we've taken for granted over the years things that we thought would go on forever the pandemic came and along with it was the disappearance of those things that we ordinarily enjoy those things that we look forward to every month maybe every quarter maybe weekly just gone like that the runs that we love the 10ks the park runs the marathons those obstacle races the spartan races tough mothers all gone but not to worry because things will be coming back soon i'm pretty sure you know one of the best things that could happen to a runner is to sign up for those runs those races that involves a lot of people during the pandemic a lot of us have been running alone which is great when you run alone obviously you get fitter it's time for you to gather your thoughts when you run alone, it's time for you to listen to music that nobody is imposing on you, the music that you want to listen to, <laughs> not the one that your kids want you to listen to. If you've got a plan that you're not sure of how to implement, running could give you time to reflect on what exactly to do. So running on your own is quite great, but nothing can beat running with other people. And that's why I'm expectant and hopeful that it's coming back soon and we'll all be able to participate in those runs. And I'm going to talk about the reasons why I think those runs are fantastic and they should be part of you if you're a runner. Before I do that, let me remind you, if you haven't already, this is a fun place to be. I can guarantee you that even if I have to say so myself, so please do subscribe. And when you do, press on that button so when I drop a new video, you get notified as soon as it happens. So running, and not just run, I'm talking about races, I'm talking about runs, I'm talking about timed runs. Why are they fantastic? Why do I think that everybody that assumes themselves as a runner should be involved? No matter how good or otherwise you might think you are as a runner, I think everyone should be involved in these runs. But why? I'm going to give you a few reasons and let's get straight into it. Number one, run alone is quite good, but it could be a bit leisurely where you take your time. You want to beat the previous time sometimes, but when you book yourself on a run with other people, then the difference is the training. You want to train not because you want to beat other people but you want to beat your previous time you want to be better you want to show yourself off as a good runner it comes with a degree of training that you would otherwise not have put yourself through when you're running alone and this obviously makes you a better runner improves your running skills and it gives you better results in terms of your overall fitness and your running ability and that is one of the reasons why I think those runs are great. Number two, the people that you meet. These are people that you ordinarily would never have met but for those races. For instance, park run. For most of us who go to park runs on Saturdays, we go to the same venue, we go to the same park run. Some of us do a lot of touring but majorly the same people meet up at the same park run. That means over time, you would make friends. Friends who would talk about nothing else but running in the main. Friends who would support each other on, encourage each other. And these are people that you ordinarily wouldn't meet. When you go for those other runs as well, for your 10Ks, for your um, 20Ks, for your half marathons, you come across interesting people people who would just make you feel better for being a runner and that's why those runs are quite key in the life of a runner number three which for me is key is the excitement that comes with those runs I just think about it so you're going for a run you've done your training and the day comes 
wake up quite early, get ready on the train, get to the venue, get loads of people there already. Your heart starts to skip many beats. <laughs> you see people who are warming up, stretching. Then you wonder, do I fit in here? Can I be part of this society? Well, you can, because it's really cool. A cool bunch of people to be part of. And then they call you guys together to do a group warm-up. You do your group warm-up and afterwards you go to the starting line. What do you do, especially when you do your maybe 10Ks or half marathon, they ask you to go up in accordance to what time you think you will finish. So for half marathons, for me for instance, um, 1 hour 50 minutes. <laughs> And then when they say, if you were going to finish within one hour, 50 minutes, then go to the starting line. <sighs> Get to the starting line and then look around. Look at my competition. <laughs> it's not a competition. But still, I'm only human. So look at my competition. <gasps> These are the people I'm running against. See the men. <clears throat> See the girls. <laughs> Ah, oh, excited! Heart is skipping many beats. And then it's time to go, set off. And then you feel a bit relaxed as you start. That excitement though, you cannot quantify it. Amazing! Number four, finishing. Just finishing. It doesn't matter how long or short that run is. I tell you about my first park run. A colleague from work had been pestering me forever to go to park run. Now I credit this guy for turning me into what I would call a runner. Anyway, he's been pestering me to go to park run. And eventually I showed up on Saturday just before nine. And then we started and then we go around three laps and at the end we go to a funnel and somebody handed me one of these barcodes and i switched it over and i saw my number i think it was number 16. i came 16th how did i do that just the sense of completion i will never forget never forget go home and about an hour later got a text you came 16th and this is classed as your PB. Yeah, I got a PB! <laughs> Whenever I go for the other runs as well, name it. Be it 5K, be it 10K, half marathon, tough mother, and I'm done. Just crossing that line. The sense of completion, you cannot quantify it. It's something that gives me so much joy and I look forward to it. I didn't tumble and fall over. I didn't embarrass myself. I didn't get injured. I actually started and finished. <gasps> How joyful is that? Love it. Love it, love it, love it. And that's one of the reasons why doing those runs is great. Really great. And finally, one of the things that separates running alone from running with a gathering of people, people that you probably do not know, well actually you do not know most of them, is the atmosphere. You can't compare the atmosphere. People sharing you on. If you're doing one of those long runs and you have your name on your shirt, people screaming your name. Is that me? Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, it's great. You know what I what I respect most about this run are the people who um sign up to be marshals. Pack run, I know it's free. They don't get paid to do that because I've been a marshal about three times. And these people are standing in strategic points of the course and apart from directing you to where to go in case you're a first timer, 
they also encourage you they clap for you say well done I want to turn that around because I've been in Marshall a few times. My gosh, do I scream. Whenever I do happen to Marshall a run, I'm screaming so much, I'm home with his sorcerers. Because I'm like, come on! Let's do this! You got one more lap to go, yeah! <laughs> the atmosphere. I remember when I did my first marathon. I was running, running, I was tired. I got to a point where every strength I had was gone, flat out, nothing left. But then I saw that big sign that says, finish. And along that line was a crowd of people. And suddenly the noise got louder. Go Ayo! <laughs> and I ran! Doom! 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 <laughs> everything I had. I gave it everything I had because the atmosphere kept me going. Got to the end, crossed that line. And yes! Done it! You can, how can you do that when you're running alone? It's not possible. Running with a group of people, when you sign up for those races, the benefits are numerous. I'll give you just a few. So when we go back to a degree of normalcy, do sign up for these runs and I guarantee you, you will never look back. Remember, this is your fitness. Take care of yourself and I will see you pretty soon.